Hello everyone, this is Omesh and in today's video I am going to show you a basic tutorial how to create a diverging chart like this. So this chart is essentially created in two hemispheres that is 2011 and 2012 and uh, this shows a portion owned by a particular element like wireless phone in those particular here like private phone here we can see it's it's uh, 8751 here it is 8861 so how to create a chart like this I will give you a quick uh, demo of that so this is the new uh, data this data has three essential fields that is the parameters so here we have wireless phone wire, wireline phone wireless phone rural phone etc and these are segregated by years 2011 and 2012 so I'm going to create a sheet on sheet I can see that I need two uh, two different years so 2011-2012 I'm creating two parameters uh, calculated fields one for 2011 After that we create for 2012, I will duplicate it. And then I will select the default property aggregation and set it as an average after this I will drag and drop this parameter on the row drag this average on 2012 and drag this on this particular on this uh, axis so it gets a shared axis now this your data will appear like this drag and drop the measure names on the color portion now it will show a stacked a stack chart now how to diverge it I will duplicate this column add it and create a negative field now this negative field will be nothing would be the same negative value of 2001-2011 positive figures okay now drag and drop this now the, this is actually required so you can see that when I drag and drop initially it was the sum because uh, somehow 2011 was not able to duplicate with all its formatting so I again recreated the field and I recreated the negative uh, negative field negative values and I have to simply drag and drop on 2011 now I will get something uh, uh, something like this now drag and drop your 2011 on the detail part here duplicate this not this one the negative one and for the 2012 the positive one and after that what you simply need to do click on the analytic pane drag and drop a reference line drag on the cell portion a window will appear make sure that per cell is selected make sure this 2000 negative is selected here and select the value so a value will be assigned to it 
uncheck this show recalculated line for highlighted or selected data point now again drag and drop the reference line cell make sure this per cell is collected uh, selected and or uh, instead of 2011 negative select 2012 select value and select ok now you can see that this chart has been created here these values are uh, are populated now these values are of negative so how to do it how to make it as a positive or appear it as a positive select the formatting option go on the custom tab you can align it in a better in little way like this to make it look good and aligned on the number portion select standard make it make it the number custom 0 make this custom as 0 comma 0 now this negative number has been changed as positive similarly you can make adjustment here so it is like this if you create it in a full uh, full view mode entire view you will get something like this now select on the parameter select sort by descending select by field and select 2012 apply ok this is how in a very uh, this is a very native way how you can create a diverging chart ok and you can make your own adjustment to make it look more good and in as per your requirements so I hope you like this video and thank you for watching it